This afternoon, the Missouri State Highway Patrol recovered the body of a woman who went underwater at Smithville Lake and didn't resurface. KCTV 5's Carolina Cruz spoke with her family, who tell us Nicole Self was a loving mom of two. Carolina. Yeah, her family says that is the most devastating part of all of this. Those girls, just seven and nine, so now their mom won't get to raise them. And one of those girls was on the boat with her mom just yesterday. Being on the water was second nature to Nicole self. It's how she spent her time off. Sunday was no different. Nicole, two friends and two kids headed to Smithville Lake to relax on Father's Day. About two hours later, her sister Fallon Self got a call. They couldn't tell me much. They just said that she dove in and didn't come back up and they tried to throw her a life jacket and she just didn't come back up. Divers with a Missouri State Highway Patrol rescue crew searched for her into the night and returned Monday morning. They found her body around noon. A spokesperson with the department says the boat either hit a rock or a tree stump. The prop broke on the boat, mm -hmm. so they were just kind of coasting back in with the current. The Missouri State Highway Patrol spokesperson says something fell into the water. Nicole jumped in to get it. The hardest part is that she's been on the water her entire life. Yes. She knew boats inside and out. She was an amazing swimmer. Uh huh. Even she has chronic so asthma, she, but never stopped her. That maybe asthma had something to do with it. They say it's hard to understand what went wrong and how something like this could happen to Nicole. Super fun and just very positive, God loving girl. She's she's gone through so much in her life and <laughs> so many regrets. It's just she's such a good person. She's such a good mom is devastating for her girls and us. Our whole family. We reached out to the Missouri State Highway Patrol to see how many water rescues they've responded to so far this year. They tell us they are working on getting us that information, so we'll update you when we know. Reporting in Smithville, I'm Carolina Cruz, KCTV 5 News. That's horribly sad. Carolina, thank you for the update.